Daniel and today I will show you how you can broadcast your audio signal live from Tractor DJ. If you're using the Spreadcaster, just select the audio tab and here you should select desktop audio on Windows. This means that the Spreadcaster is now broadcasting live all signals that you can hear on your desktop, including Tractor DJ. But to make sure that you use or that you get the audio signal of Tractor DJ, just click on settings and here you can choose the sound card of your system. If you click here, you can also see the sound card. It shows that it's currently used as a speaker. And in this case, I will also use it here as an audio device. So now Tractor Pro will run all audio sounds and audio um, signals on the desktop. This means when I click on play right now, we will be able to hear all sounds on the laptop itself and not on the speakers, which are connected to the DJ controller. So you shouldn't choose the microphone. You shouldn't choose a tractor control. Just choose your sound card of your system in the shared mode. Then you can click on close. And when you click on play right now, you can hear the signal right from your speakers from the laptop or notebook that you're using. And we already selected desktop audio here on the Spreadcaster. We have chosen our visual and we have chosen the destinations to which we want to broadcast live. So now you can click on start broadcasting and then you will be live on all these platforms and you will also be able to listen to the sound of your tractor mix live and in highest quality on all these platforms. If you have any questions regarding audio input, regarding the setting up of your destinations or even regarding visuals, Maybe you even have some ideas for future features. Just let me know. You can always contact me. My email is daniel at spreadmix.com and I'm very much looking forward to talking to you and I wish you a great and happy streaming session.